Let's write the name for KCN. So first off, we have potassium here, which is a metal. And then we have CN. This is a group of nonmetals. This is a polyatomic ion. So the metal, the nonmetals, this is going to be an ionic compound. So we'll have to name this as an ionic compound. So first off, K, that's potassium on the periodic table. So we just write potassium. For the CN, you're not going to find that on the periodic table. You need to either memorize that CN is the cyanide ion, or if you're allowed, you can look it up. So we have our potassium, and then we write the name of the polyatomic ion. That's the cyanide ion. And that's the name for KCN, potassium cyanide. If you were given the name potassium cyanide and asked to write the formula, you need to know that you have potassium, the metal, and then cyanide, a polyatomic ion. So you'd write potassium and then the cyanide. And since K, potassium's in group one, it's one plus the whole cyanide ion. That's always one minus. The charges balance out. So the formula for potassium cyanide, that just be KCN. This is Dr. B with the name for KCN. It's potassium cyanide. Thanks for watching.